Hello and welcome wherever you're watching. This is Goodison Park. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And it is a day of renewal, the first game of the Premier League season. Always something to look forward to. It's Everton versus Southampton. Well, the atmosphere is incredible inside the stadium, Derek. There's a real sense of optimism amongst the fans about the new season and what it might bring. It's been a long wait, but hopefully we get a great game to kick their campaigns off. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford is the keeper. Luca Digne plays with Leo Dubois in the fullback positions. Abdoulaye Dukure plays alongside Alan in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Walker Peters. Well, it is without question a very special day. This his debut match. Stuart, what should we expect to see from him? Well, they've needed something different, and he will certainly offer that because his movement is clever, he makes dynamic runs, and he's a good box player. Let's hope he shows us all those qualities today. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Santimina. Ward Prowse. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. They might be able to get in now. And he takes on the shot. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. So the corner played into the box missing the target by a tiny margin well it's a difficult skill to get right but he almost pulled it off there he made such good contact with the ball <laughs> Elianusi and Santi Mina with it Elianusi that's a very impressive piece of defending. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. And back with Gordon. Takes the shot. Well, able to close down the shot. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Elianusi, Mohamed Salisu. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward, but quick thinking defensively. Sigurdsson. On the ball, Andros Townsend. And return to Sigurdsson. And the keeper caught there. The corner from Gilfi Sigurdsson. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Digne. And possibilities inside the box. And an effective clearance. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? No let-up in the pressing department. An attack full of promise. And a goal! Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal.
the opening goal of the game then Well, the stats confirm it. Southampton have had the lion's share of possession, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly need to up the tempo if they're going to get back into this one. El Yunusi. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Putting his body on the line. The first half here comes to an end. So they get the ball rolling once more, and it's advantage Everton after the first half. Let's see what the second 45 has in store for us. Yeri Mina. Alan. Moving the ball effectively. An alert piece of defending. A sly draw pass. Can he put it away? Well, and they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Even Steven won a piece on this match. A chance to whip it in. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. And problem solved for now. Well, great read there to intercept. Digne, teammates in the middle. And he clears the danger. Well, the counter chance looks very real. How can he take them on and beat them? And let's give credit to the defending. And we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV. It's Everton taking on Leeds United. He's got to score! Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. So there we have it, 2-1. Well, Everton haven't bossed the possession, as you can see, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Well, nicely cut out. Just a reminder, we have more absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV. It's Southampton facing Manchester United. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Armstrong. Walcott. 
Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Everton unable to retain possession. And the minutes are ticking away. Can Everton get over the line? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. Really getting stuck in. And news of a goal at Stamford Bridge. Alex Scott has all the information for us. It's a goal for Chelsea. They've pulled ahead by three with 85 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. A routine save. And only two minutes remaining here. Elianusi. Nicely cut out. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. This could level it. And he read it really well. Fine save. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Superb block. Ball is loose. So the referee blows for full time, and it's an Everton success story, whatever way you look at it. Three points for the Toffees. What did you think of their performance? Yes, Derek, that's exactly the start you want. Yes, one or two players looked a little bit tired towards the end of the game, but that's to be expected. Overall, I thought it was a really good display. takes on the shot really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing